There are two types of people in the coronavirus crisis. In this video, you're gonna find out which one you are and which one is successful. Now listen, right now, if you are on the verge of quitting, if you are thinking this is not gonna work, I want you to understand that that is not an option. That is not an option at all. This is not about you. It is about the people that you are here to serve, to help, and to lift up. You are here to be the hope, the light, the optimism for the people that are struggling. They're stuck and they're struggling. And you might feel like you are stuck and struggling and spinning your wheels, and you might have had a bunch of things happen to you. You may have lost your job. You may have lost some business but you haven't lost your future. And so I want you to think about, I want you to future cast that when you think about yourself at 90 years old in your artificially intelligent powered digital rocking chair, I want you to think what, what would I tell my younger self? Would I be proud of my younger self for what I'm doing right now? Would I be looking back and going, I took the easy way out or would I be sitting there going, that person turned into a lion leader? That's right, lead like a lion. I love this great quote, and it goes like this. An army of sheep led by a lion will beat an army of lion led by a sheep. And you right now have the two choices. You have the choice to become that sheep, to buckle down, to hide away, to be embarrassed by what might have happened to you, to cower against the critics who might attack you online. I know I'm gonna get a thumbs down for this video. It's not gonna stop me from making it because you, you are gonna be impacted by it. So that's the first type of person. You also get the chance to become a lion, to become a lion in your leadership, a lion who shows up every single day, even when it's been hurt, when it's been clawed, when it's bleeding, when maybe it lost the fight yesterday, but it hasn't lost the war. You can be the lion. You can be the lion that goes to the other lions in its pride, and you can show them the way out of it. You can show them a better future, because there is a better future ahead. I know that for you. I know because I've studied history, and yes, we are going through tough times right now, but tough times don't last. Tough people like you and myself, we last. We last, and we are gonna make the right decisions moving forward. So you have that choice. Cower, be a sheep, hide from the world, protect yourself, protect your ego, don't make the video, don't start the new business, don't try and pick yourself up off the ground. Put your tail between your legs, go home, move into your parents' basement, let them take care of you. I'm not even gonna go on because it's not even an option. Quitting is not an option for you. Instead, you're gonna take the other path. You're gonna become that lion and you're gonna be a proactive person, not reactive. Reactive people, I have seen gym owners, I have seen restaurant owners, I have seen coaches, I have seen copywriters, I have seen real estate agents shut down mentally, physically. I can't do anything, I'm gonna quit, don't ever talk to me, don't ever try and get me back on track. They've just hit the panic button. They're reactive, and they tune into the media every single day. They fill their thoughts with toxicity. Don't do that, please, please. For all things good and holy, don't do that. You've been blessed. You've been blessed with your senses, with your physical body, with your mental capacity, and here you are, you're gonna quit, become a blob on the couch, eating junk, getting overweight, lowering your energy. Don't do that. Instead, go from reactive, shift into proactive mode. The proactive person says, you know what? If I can't control the world out there, I can control the world in here, the world in here, the world in here, what goes in here. I can control that. I control my output, my effort, my beliefs, I control the fact that I can wake up every day and as my good friend Alan Cosgrove would say, 
Your mind is a garden, plant good things. Then water it. Water the good things in your mind. Wake up every morning at a certain time. Make a promise the night before, I'm gonna get up at 7 a.m. And then you do not hit snooze because when you hit snooze, you lose. You lose out on your hopes and dreams. You say, hopes and dreams, you don't matter. Forget about you. What matters to me is comfort, safety, security, hiding under my covers, hoping the big bad boogeyman problems of the world are gonna go away. They're not, they're not. You're only gonna get bigger problems as we go forward. And so if you're young and you think life is gonna get easier, it's not. If you're older like me and you think life is somehow just magically become a yellow brick golden road, it's not. Whatever we go back to, whether it's a normal or a new normal or whatever people wanna call it, I don't care what you're gonna call it. I'm, you know, I'm just going forward to the future where it's optimistic to me and it's optimistic to you too because you're gonna wake up and you're gonna to commit to yourself. And when you get up on time, you're gonna go, dang, that's right. And you build that confidence. And then you say, you know what? For that first hour, I'm gonna focus on building a high income skill, sales, copywriting, speaking. Sales, copywriting, speaking, high income skills. I'm gonna spend an hour, two hours working on that. I'm gonna make myself valuable to the world. I'm gonna show up every day. I'm gonna ship my content, post my content, say my phrases, tell my story, help other people. I'm gonna learn, I'm gonna figure out what I can sell and I'm gonna grow a business. And I might make $10 this week and $50 the next week, but soon, Soon you'll be on the path, scaling your offer, figuring things out because you are proactive and you say, this is a schedule I will keep and I will not let the negative news get in my head, the toxicity that shuts me down. Instead, I will stand up to it and I will move ahead because these are tough times, but I'm tougher. And I always say to my clients, I say, whatever it is in your way, you are better than it, you are stronger than it and you are gonna beat it and you have to believe it because I believe in you and it's time for you to believe in you too. It's time for you to become that lion. You have the skills, you have the opportunity, you have the mental capacity, you have the energy, you have the technology. Nobody's short on technology right now. We've got the phone, we've got the computer. We can make money from it. We can learn, we can go to YouTube. There's so much stuff for free. We don't have to invest thousands of dollars in a college education. We don't have to move across the country or around the world in order to get smarter. There are so many amazing TED Talks and Harvard University classes and all these things are online available to us for us to learn. We can go and we can read books from millionaires, billionaires. Jeff Bezos, the first soon to be trillionaire. We can learn figure out, reverse engineer, but not quit. The list of things you can do is exponentially long. And the list of things that you cannot do is one thing. One thing and one thing only, and that is quit. You cannot ever quit. What I want you to do is commit to a certain time. You get up, commit to an activity, you do that, commit to the next thing, you do that, and so on and so forth. One activity, one decision, one commitment at a time. And the follow through builds your confidence. And the next thing you know, people are noticing in it. They're noticing how different you are. They're noticing you're not like those other people who have given up. You're a proactive person. And that's when you're the 11 out of 10 every single day. When your mindset is there, and you might not have the breakthrough tomorrow, you might not have it 30 days from now, but I guarantee you as a formerly broke, struggling, introverted, socially anxious, binge drinking personal trainer who hated being all of those things, that I turned my life around, doing exactly what I'm telling you to do. Even though I was depressed, I had anxiety, I went to the emergency room with all of it, but I didn't stop showing up. I became more proactive every single day, even in the face of deep difficulty. And I changed my life. I knew I could. I knew you can. I'm gonna see you do it. I'm gonna hear from you. You're gonna drop a comment down below. You're gonna send me an email at craig at godfather.com. You're gonna buy my books. You're gonna hit me up on Instagram. You're gonna do all of these things. And you're gonna change your life. All right? I've given you the motivation. 
I've got courses, I've got books, I've got articles, I've got Instagram videos, I've got more YouTube videos that give you the plan. Consume them every single day and then take action. 90 minutes of action every single day. Do the hardest things first. And this, my friend, this one choice to go from reactive to proactive is what's gonna separate you from everyone else. It's gonna get you through the crisis. It's gonna make you tougher in tough times. And we're gonna compress 10 years of living into one year right now, a decade in a year. Think of all the experience and all the education you got in the last decade. Well, you're gonna get all of that in the next 12 months if you commit because the pressure is on. And pressure, as my friend Tim Grover says, is a privilege. If you feel pressure right now, it's a privilege to feel that. If you feel stressed, it's because people depend on you, because they believe in you. And I believe in you too. It's time for you to do the same. So my friend, enough, enough of the video. It's time for you to go and take action. We believe in you, the world believes in you. It's time for you to believe in you too. Drop me a comment about the number one thing you're gonna do right now to move ahead and what you're gonna shed from the past to move forward. And when you're ready to go to the next level, if you need help, if you're like, I am actually doing okay, I need more of this, Craig, go to craigballantine.com, send me a message there, and we'll give you the coaching you need to scale to six figures, seven figures, and make a big impact in the world. We'll see you soon.